What is going on guys, it's Thomas over here, I'm doing a first look for the game Path of Exile now, I just listened to the guard talking to you, and how he was talking about you were exiled from some major city, and you choose one weapon, which is basically the class that you choose, and they say good luck and all that good stuff, your, your chance to start a new life, all that good stuff, so I'm just going to start a new account in this, and it's, uh, this is a stress test weekend where they're trying to test out the servers, see if it's strong enough to hold the player base that they expect to come uh, when they open into open beta. And I, I finally got into this one because there was two previously, one in March, one before that, and I missed both of them, and I was not able to obtain a key, and yeah, so basically I'm just making a new account in this one since it's the first time I'm playing this game. So I guess this is me, and this isn't cutscene, I have to walk up. So here we are, pick up this weapon, this is the one weapon they're talking about, and depends on your class, so let's talk to this guy over here. You and I, we're not the only ones made it. Not counting my quiet phone over here, why don't I execute us? That's basically coming with all the important bits, for a uh, small source mode, give me some help. Whoa, whoa, get off him. Okay, I'm going to assume he is now dead. Hold out to shot items on the ground. Glacial hammer, one, and I'm guessing, because I've read about this, that you can equip it. Here we go, I, and we'll just equip that onto our weapon. There we go, now we get a new skill. And as you guys probably can tell, just by looking at the game, you can tell, you know, it looks a lot like Diablo, and, and it plays like Diablo too. It's point and click system, uh, left and right click for attacks, your HP bar and MP bar, like, uh, look exactly the same as it. Um, so yeah, it has a really Diablo feel to it, and the fact that you can hold out to see items and that stuff, makes it easier to pick up items because usually if items are really small it's hard, harder to pick it up but right now combat seems smooth this skill looks pretty good that guy just shattered over there and there's lots of corpse I just kicked that guy over how disrespectful of me so we're just going around is there a quest like is there any certain goal I have to reach right now um, let's just use some potions over here. So I read that you can't naturally heal, so you must use potions all the time. And the potions over here, they refill over time, so that means you basically have a maximum and it regenerates the potion. Well, I'm lagging a lot. But yeah, that's how the HP and stuff works. Basically, your potions refill naturally. You don't refill HP and MP naturally, but yeah, you just keep using it all the time. And I don't know why I'm killing these guys. I should be looking for a quest. Um, quest can't be Q because that's down there. Open world panel. There we go, that looks more like it. Let's just walk up to that question mark. And let's see how deep into the ocean I can go. Oh, no, not deep at all. I can just stop there. But let's kill these guys with my glacial hammer. Pretty powerful skill for a level 1 skill. Look at me just pound these guys. Look at that. That's a pretty strong skill. So let's see. I need to head up shore. And he talked about an encampment. Saw some smoke up there. I'm just going to head up there. And just to skip some of these monsters, shall we? Because I don't want to spend too long just attacking monsters again and again and again. So we're just going to walk past. Pretty sure this has to be the way. This has to be the way. Let's go with you. Yep, we just have to walk up the shore, tabs the map. There, we should be coming close. That guy is very, extremely large. Additional life, yes, I can tell. Yet they say nothing about his height. Like, they don't say, like, abnormally tall or something like that. So we're just spamming left clicks and stuff. And pow, pow. There we go. That guy just pulled a weapon out of his body. This is extremely unfair now. This is... Okay. So, combat is... Okay, I'm dying. I'm dying. Run. So, combat is basically click. I'm not sure if it's auto. Like, if I, I, I click on him once, only hits once. There has to be an option to turn it on. But I can't actually find it. I am dying, my potions are off, and I'm just going to run this way and come back and take one more shot. Yeah, there we go, guys. So, enter the shore encampment for your reward. Okay, I will do so. I only hold out, pick up these items. There we go. And pop some potions while I look at this. Yeah, there's my quest complete. And this is this works like Diablo, as you can see. I don't know why I keep measuring Diablo, but still, you can see the axe over here. You can see uh, it works in a linear progression so storyline and you basically go around the island and it's act one if you play Diablo there's a f act five something like this and yeah this is a multiplayer game and unlike Diablo it isn't server based like you don't create your own server it's all it's MMORPG so that means you basically have one whose server contains a, 
a whole lot of people and that's how it works but um am I still level 1? yes I am I am level 1 that makes me sad these are other players in town I'm guessing yep everyone's level 2 good good I'm level 1 I don't know why so Nessa your home exile isn't much of advice to say um goodbye I guess stash whoa I have a lot of items yeah this is my uh my items from before because I played it made a previous guy so I knew what to do from then but uh, new quest find medicine case okay let me just check my items see if I can equip anything I have 5 to 8 this one seems better critical chance is lower attacks per second as well 20% increased on enemies uh, I might might use this one. Oh, what's this one exactly the same I just have two of the exact same weapon weapon class claw one handed mace let's equip this actually and I need to sock it out and I can't actually equip into there, unfortunately. So I'm gonna have to stick with this Skepta. So I can't actually change weapons for now, but that doesn't matter. Take that out. And I should be good to go. There's nothing else I need to fix or anything. Nope, everything's good. Alright, let's go. I'll talk to this guy for the quest. Bestel. What a nice name that is. How come I haven't leveled up yet? I want EXB. Alright, now I've got two quests. But I'm just gonna finish the one that's closest first. Oh, wow, even more quests. This is a town in the end so yeah there should be a lot of quests. Oh select one reward. Huh. Blue Ice Nova Circle of Ice. I like AoE spells. I move randomly until they hit enemy. Slam to ground in front of it, creating a wave forward. Oh I want this AoE one. Let's grab that. Can I put it over there? Goodbye. Quest complete. Yes it is so now I have the the question mark on I can just finally move on to a new place. So interesting I'm now entering the terraces over here and seeing what I can find. Do, 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 do. Okay, now how do I use this spell? Um, what is that? Middle click? That is middle click. Okay, middle click's kind of hard to press for me because it's you can actually slide up and down. That's okay. I'll manage. I want to try to use it when I get a big mob of them. So, where exactly do I have to go? Hmm. I'll just navigate this. I'm guessing I have to go up there because it looks like it's important. Everything's important. Okay, middle click. Oh, I, I keep I kept spamming it so not nothing came out. I'm guessing you can actually stop it. You just go keep spamming. Oh no, it works. I don't know why it didn't work last time. Maybe I got hit something, but what a, what a nice world it is. So I have one passive skill point. So I'm guessing all the other ones are active, and this tree is really big. I just saw it in my last account, and it there's a lot of skills. I would guess about. Um, 400 maybe 400 skills passive skills Wait, let me just close it out and open it again here we go okay let's upgrade what we can I'm going go for mana regen simply because I want to spam a lot of spells because spells seem to be more powerful than my physical attacks and if I mob up enough of these guys casting my uh casting my spells will be much more worth it which I'm just going to do now so as I said before this is an Stress test open beta weekend where it's basic. They're basically just testing their server, seeing it, if it's strong enough to hold as many people as they expect to expect to come as soon as the game goes free to play. And so yeah, but you can actually purchase closed beta keys right now. They, they are on sale, uh, which limits the player base. And I'm just died there. It limits the player base, and so that they don't have to have too many people on at the same time. If that made any sense at all. So I'm just gonna kill these guys. There's a lot of people here, so I'm assuming we're meant to go up here. I should go wisdom. Get off that. Um, tab, map. I don't know. Let's just level this up. Oh, you can actually level each individual skill, and I died. I wasn't paying attention. I was leveling my skill. So basically, you use the skill enough times, it will level up. And when you level the skill up, it of course gets stronger. And that's how you basically level up. You when you level up as well, you get passive skill points, and you upgrade your skills with that. And I'm guessing you naturally get stronger, like your stats, like your strength, intelligence, and all that good stuff gets stronger as well. But I have no idea where to go, so I'm just picking up all these items which I missed. Because I obviously didn't see them. Pick up there, stop hitting me, man. That's it, you pay. Let me check my tab again. Okay, quest. Uh, I, I should probably head this way. Okay, I don't think that's a possibility. I don't think heading into the water is a possibility. Let's head this way. This, this part looks kind of... Oh no, this loads more terrain actually. Let's just go head up. Head up here. And let's 
usually if you get lost, it's always nice to find notable terrains, like something that's different from what it is. Because right now I'm just walking on the beach, I want to find something different. I want to find something that, that seems like there's something important somewhere. I'm going to pop my HD potion before I die. There's a lot of fire here. No, no, don't die. Don't die. There we go. I clicked to level up. My skill now do much more damage. Ice Nova. Pretty good skill. I love I love those skills where you can just mob a lot of people at the same time. And uh, yeah, much better than the single target spells because of course in PvP it helps if you're one on one, but but how often do you one on one? Wow, I have a lot of potions now. Can I switch order? No, I can't. So I have a lot of MP pots and HP pots. So basically that's what I'm talking about. It automatically refills, which is good because you can just keep casting spells again and again or healing HP. And I can't break that crate open. It's just an unbreakable crate somehow. I'm walking a straight line. This one looks like it's going somewhere. This one's just a narrow passage. Oh, wow. Oh, this is a party. I am not invited. I'm just gonna keep spamming the spell. This spell is powerful. Can you just imagine me taking these guys one on one? Like, that would not work. You just need one of these big spells and you need MP, which I don't have enough of. So let's just pop some MP. And there, level up so quickly. Just from grinding these humongous mobs, I was able to level up. This game seems so fast paced already. Like, like the, 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 you know, it's like a lot of things happening at the same time. It requires timing, it requires speed, it requires positioning. Of course, to use my skill, you have to like stand somewhere in the middle of everyone. I can't pick this up. And if you guys notice when I put my inventory, it works Diablo-wise. Like, when you, um, how can I explain it? Each item takes out a specific number of slots, squares in this case, and you need to put it in an order that you can fit all the items as much as you can. So obviously, you don't want to have, for example, uh, one block in the middle because I would just block an item that could fit by three and you have to put over there so it, you can fit an item over there. So that's the kind of inventory system that this game uses. And I, it's pretty good. It, it keeps it more realistic seeing that you have to actually, and yeah, just, just equipping items requires some uh, amount of knowledge, I guess. And amount of try hard. <laughs> and Driftwood Wand. Do I want wands? I don't know. Why is this quality plus 8%? Is my item not of good quality? I don't understand what that means. But let's continue on. Let's try to finish one more quest before I call this video off and see what we can find. Nice, I'm just walking backwards, aren't I? Ah, oh, no, pull out the map. There's a small opening down here. Yep, small opening. I'll just turn right since I went came from the left. And there's a lot of people. As usual, I didn't take down the map. I, I don't think I noticed the map was on when I was in, in the last fight. But I do now, so. It's okay. Kill everyone. Uh, it seems like the comments are a little bit off. Like when you hit them, you don't they don't take damage until much later. Like not much later, but like sometimes it just misses or they. I don't know if it's part of the system where you can miss attacks or they just block the attack. But it seems like some of my hits are just not registering and it just passes by. And basically, I just attack for no particular reason. Let's clear these guys. And continue walking down. Whoa, that guy's a spellcaster. What is this? Five Fury. I'm guessing this is where I have to be because this guy obviously knows too many spells and I know nothing. Look at him. Wow, this guy. Now, let's just target that guy. Target the one guy. Bash him. Bash him. Harder. Okay, that, that, that was quite a bit of damage. Like, I'm just hitting my potions from left to right. I'm just using every single one I could possibly use, and the guy finally died. So, there we go. Some items. Wool, sh wool shoes. Shoes. That's a tongue twister. You know, how often do you see those kind of shoes anyway? So, let's open that and pick those items up. There we go. He used it, so it must be good. NG shield. Okay, that's pretty good. It's unidentified, but I'm pretty sure I had an item that can identify that. Like this. There we go. 8% code resistance, I guess I'll equip this since he were and he just casted spells like a boss. So I'm just gonna equip it for now as well. My HP bar has a cool thing over there. I think that's the code resistance that I was talking about. Cause why else would we be blue? There we go, clear a few more mobs and let's quickly hurry up and see where I have to go. Mm, this map keeps going forever. This is no end. This is more to the level 2 normal difficulty default league. Do, 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 do. Okay, I'm just walking into the water. This is not. Oh, there's a portal here. It looks like. Yeah, Mont Flat. There we go. A new map finally. 
Now we can do some cool stuff and uh, grind higher level monsters. This field looks pretty cool. This, this is some detailed map. Level 4 monsters, what level am I? Level 3, I can do it with this. Come on. One more level high is nothing. Okay, that looks a kinda. Let's see if I can take this guy on. Yeah. No different from the other map, actually. They don't charge the enemies. Nope. No when you're frozen. Take that guy out. And let's mob as many people as I can. I can cast this spell. There we go. Cost a lot of MP, but. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. Kill those guys and continue on. Hmm. Tab. I I don't think this is where I'm meant to be for my quest. Yeah, I passed it. Nah, I can keep going out for the quest. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I might make a follow up video since this is the last day in which I can play this game. But anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you liked the video, please subscribe, comment, and like the video, and uh, see you guys later.